What's up everybody, it's Apex Guardian, and we are back with another Starfield glitch. So, uh, this glitch is actually going to include two other glitches I've covered previously on the channel, so I'll link those around, but uh, we're also going to just cover them again, just for ease of access. So, to get unlimited weapons and unlimited ammo, uh, and, and in turn, unlimited credits, all you're going to need is an outpost anywhere you want, go to build your outpost, uh, you don't have to do this inside of a, a hab, just for the sake of safety in monsters and whatnot, or aliens. I'm going to do it inside of my hab. So you're going to want to get some polymer and titanium, go over to displays, weapon cases, and place down whatever weapon cases you want, as many as you want. The sky is the limit. Actually, now that I think about it, there is a build limit. So the sky isn't the limit, the build limit's the limit. Uh, you can place any of the sort, it all works. It, it does not matter which ones you use. Uh, you can even do the small ones. So once you have placed down all of your weapon cases, simply uh, quick save. Once you've quick saved, just hit load. Load the quick save you just made. This will fill up every single one of these weapon cases with a weapon. Now, oh, and ammo. So once you've done that, all you have to do is uh, go to your outpost beacon and hold R to remove your outpost. This will delete everything and all the items will go straight into your inventory. It's a way easier way of collection. Once you've done that, uh, just simply check your inventory uh, it'll go into your cargo hold of your ship, so just go to weapons, and uh, take a quick look, see if there's anything in here that you want. Uh, I already had the Staggering Rescue Axe, but this Tesla drum beat is new, so if that's something you're interested in, uh, go ahead and pull that out. Now from here, you're going to want to go to the Soul System, which is for reference right here. Once in the Soul System, you want to fly towards Venus. Once you're at Venus, uh, land literally anywhere. Okay, so once you've landed on Venus, you're going to be looking for a civilian outpost. So you can easily find this by pulling out your scanner, looking around at the available structures nearby. Uh, and when you see them, just press E to scan. You can scan them up to 1200 meters away and that will reveal what they are. So you can see there's one there, it's just outside of 1200 meters. It looks like a little igloo with a flag on top. That's what you're going to be trying to find. Okay, so once you found an outpost that has an interior, some only have exteriors, and if the vendor is outside, it won't work. So if you found one with an interior, simply open up your scanner, make an outpost nearby. Once you've made your outpost, uh, simply go to the landing pad with shipbuilder and place it down somewhere. Uh, the next thing you're going to want to do is find your ship. So if you weren't over encumbered, you can just teleport to your ship. Go back to space and then land at your outpost. So once you've done that, simply enter the civilian outpost. Once you're in the civilian outpost, find the nearest chair. Take a seat, and then to perform this glitch, this is the wait anywhere glitch, you're going to want to hit your wait button and move forward. You're going to want to hit your wait button maybe a microsecond before you move forward. It is normal for this to take several tries. It is a very time sensitive glitch. Once you pull it off, you'll get that little wait icon, but it'll look like you're standing up. You can just tab out of that and you'll get the wait option at the bottom still. Then just go to your uh, local vendor. Once you're at your local vendor, uh, go to sell. Go to sell from ship inventory. Go to your weapons. Start selling your weapons till they run out of vendor credits in the top right corner there. Once they've run low on credits, just tab out. You can stay as long and as then you press B or press your wait key. Wait for one hours, which is 100 hours UT time. Once your waiting is done, you should be able to trade with them again and they will have the full 5,000 credits once again. 
as you can see there, and then just simply go ahead and sell those weapons. And you can repeat this as long as you need to. It just makes the 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 weight glitch isn't like fully necessary, but it speeds the whole thing up so much faster. You don't have to wait for the weight animation anymore. It just makes the whole process way way faster. It actually gives you a, a means to sell those duplicated weapons that you got from the previous glitch. So if you guys found this video helpful or useful in any way, don't forget to like the video. Maybe consider hitting that subscribe button for more Starfield glitches. And uh, maybe leave a comment with uh, your opinions on how Bethesda's been patching the game lately. Personally, I feel they should focus on the game breaking glitches instead of the credit glitches, at least this early into the game. But that's just me. Anyways guys, thanks for watching. I'll see y'all next time. Peace!